Hey guys, it's Alex here, creator of the CrocFit app, and welcome back to my YouTube channel for today's workout, which is a dumbbell hit workout. And I'm doing this workout because there's an existing workout that I've done with many of you guys, and so many of you love the existing one that I have. So I'm repeating it with the same structure, with new exercises for you. You're gonna absolutely love it. It's one, to get the heart rate up, burn a load of calories, but also build full body strength and muscle because we're using the resistance of the dumbbells. Also, we're gonna be using some top chart music in this video. So I'm gonna give you the cues, give you some coaching points, and then be a little bit quieter than normal so we can enjoy the good music, okay? So get your dumbbells and let's go. Okay, starting the warm up down on the ground into a back roll, hug the knees in, Rolling forwards and backwards, rolling your spine, massaging your back, and sitting up tall. 30 seconds on each exercise, with five exercises in the warm up. Start with stretching that lower back. Okay, come to pause in this dead bug position. Arms up, legs up, alternate arm and leg, extend out, come back to the middle and switch sides, 30 seconds. Keep your stomach in, back flat on the floor, engaging in the stomach and the arms. Okay, turn around into a front plank position. And from this high plank, I want you to push back, bend the knees, push the bum back, and come back to plank. Push back and back to plank. Use the shoulders and arms, core engaged, and warming up in the legs as well. Try to ride all your Okay, from there, jump up into a deep squat. Sit down low in your squat, feet flat on the ground, sit your heels back, toes pushing down, push the knees out, sit down low, and then work in a rotation. One arm at a time, rotate, reach up, extend back down, rotate, reach up the other side whilst keeping a good quality squat. Okay, come to standing position. And let's finish off in a light jog. Just getting the heart rate up and continuing to get the blood pumping through the body. Final exercise here before we move into the main circuit. So, 40 seconds work, 20 seconds rest, five exercises, three rounds non-stop. It's gonna to be tough, 15 minutes, but I will show you and talk you through ways to make it easier and ways to make it harder as we go. Okay, rest there, grab a drink if you need. Exercise one, we are going for the dumbbells. I have a kilogram dumbbells. I'm going for a dumbbell squat, and when you're ready, a dumbbell squat jump. At any point, these exercises can be done without the dumbbells, okay? Exercise one starts in seven seconds. Dumbbell squat or dumbbell squat jump. Three, two, one, let's go. 40 seconds. When you need to go to a normal squat, that's fine. Chest up, sit the bum back, use the legs. Halfway. Ten seconds. Three, two, one, and rest for twenty. We're going into a push-up with the hands on the dumbbells. Four push-ups. One, two, three, four of those, and then two squat jumps. So upper body and core, starting in five, four, three, two. One, 
four push-ups. One, two, three, four, two, squat thrusts. Carry on, same combo. Good technique. Drop the knees if you need to. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, and dress there. Moving on into the squat clean. Both dumbbells. The squat clean, you need to clean up into the shoulders, squat down and stand. Drop back down, clean up to the shoulders, squat and stand. Three, two, one, squat clean. Shoulders, squat. Good technique, use the legs. Use the hip drive up to the shoulders and squat. If you're able to catch the dumbbells in the squat, that's what we're looking for. In that front loaded position. Keep going. Last couple of reps. Three, two, one, and rest. Moving on into ice skater. Using one dumbbell. Hold it with both hands, balance on one leg, dumbbell goes this side of the body, jump, switch, jump, switch. Let's go. If this is tough, drop the dumbbell, do it without, or hold something that isn't heavy, like a foam roller. Building that strength, athleticism, through the body, halfway. Core strong, stomach in, 10 seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Final exercise of the circuit. Both dumbbells again. Back to upper body, we're going four. Bent over row, four reps, two bicep curls. Go for one, two, three, four of those. Stand, two curls, and repeat. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Stand, one, two, carry on. Halfway. Ten seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Twenty seconds rest. You now know the five exercises. Let's repeat that again two times going. I'll cue you in. You know the exercises. Find a level that's good for you. Lighter weight, heavier weight, less reps, no weight at all, that's absolutely fine. Get ready for squat jump in three, two, one. Here we are, round two. If this gets tough, you've got two options. Normal squat with the weight, or drop the weight and carry on squat jump. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Rest. Down into the push-ups. Ten 
four push-ups, two squat thrusts. Three, two, one, let's go. Squat clean. Finding that movement, learn the pattern and just try to improve. Three, two, one, clean. Squat. Good quality squat. Chest up, bum down. If you want to do it with an item like this to practice, that's fine. Five, four, three, two, one, let's go. Twist in the hips, stomach working. 10. Three, two, one, rest. Let's finish round two strong. With four bent over rows, two bicep curls. Deep breaths in. You got this, focus. Three, two, one, let's go. Bend over right. Two curls. Get another one in there. One, two, three, four. One, two, rest. Two rounds complete. Let's do it one more time. You're doing well, keep pushing. Push as hard as you can in this next five minutes under good control and good technique. Let's get ready for the squat jump. When it gets tough, keep pushing. Three, two, one, let's go. Halfway. Work on that strength, power. Ten. Three. 
three, two, one. Oh. Push up. Four push ups, two squat thrusts. Three, two, one. Good technique, more reps than ever. Push it. Death, chest to floor. Keep going, so close. Three, two, one. Oh yes, back up you come. Final set here, keep pushing through. Into the squat clean. Oh. Oh. Hope you're enjoying the music. Keep pushing through, stay motivated. Three, two, one, squat clean. Good technique always. Never round your back. Chest up. Keep going. 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Rest. Ice skater. Final time in the ice skater. It's a leg heavy workout. That's good, that gets the heart rate up high. Which is what we want today. Let's go. Can you go any wider than you were before? A bigger jump. Halfway. Don't stop. Don't give up. You're so close. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, let's finish the circuit with four bent over rows, two bicep curls. Work in the back and biceps. Breathe in. Five, four, three, two, one. Squeeze those biceps. Halfway, two more rounds. At my speed. One more. Three, two, one, and rest. Rest for 20, for one secret finisher. Exercise, devil's press. We go down into a burpee between the dumbbells. Jump it up, squat, swing under your body, rise above your head. Okay, take it step by step. Three, two, one, dumbbells down. Burpee to the floor, jump up, good squat. Swing it under, into shoulders, and press. If you can do that in one motion, do it. We have one minute of work to finish the workout. Devil press, always good technique. Use the momentum of the dumbbells. Swing under, drive up. 
to shoulders, swing under and place. 30 seconds, push it. to finish the workout. Three, two, one, and rest. Uh, workout complete. We made it. That is just 16 minutes, but my God. Oh, it is 16 minutes of relentless non-stop. So well done. Focus on the breathing. Dumbbells can be put to one side until another day. Come down to your hands and knees. Keep thinking about that breath. Uh, sit back, onto your heels, lengthen through the spine. Relaxing. Step one leg up into a kneeling hip flexor stretch. Get that comfortable kneeling position. Reach the arms up. Squeeze this back glute here to open up the front hip flexor here. Relax, step back and switch. Make sure that you really focus and prioritize the stretching. I know we just do a few minutes at the end of a workout, but Stretching should be a part of your daily routine. If you need help with that, then check out my stretching playlist. I have full stretches there for you, ready and waiting for you to go. Lay on your back. Let's take it to a figure four. Good stretch. Bring one ankle above the knee. Reach through the gap. Pull that leg in. Relax the head down. So obviously it's good after workout to do the stretches, but as a part of your daily routine, as morning or evening or both, just stretching off the body. Really great for improving your mobility, flexibility, uh, injury, prehab, to make sure that you don't get injured. Switch legs. to the end of this workout now that you've enjoyed these stretches. Let's turn it around onto your front, into the down dog position, walk the heels away, and as you walk them away, start to step the feet in to your hands. Relax your head, relax your shoulders. And then walk your hands up to standing. Oh yes! That is dumbbell hit, complete. This workout would have burned a ton of calories, the amount of time that it is, and also build full body muscle with just some dumbbells. I use eight kilograms each hand throughout the whole workout. I had the 12 and a half just in case I felt good, maybe in the future. So let me know which weight you're using. You can do this a couple or three times a week, depending on what other workouts you are doing for my channel or that you have in your routine. Make sure you're doing full body workouts, you're not missing any legs or chest or shoulders or arms. You're doing a mix of um, cardio, hip, but also some low intensity strength as well, depending on your goals. I see your comments all the time and almost always the answer is, it depends. It depends on you as an individual. So if you need that individual help, then please get in touch, email me or download the CrocFit app and join the CrocFit community to try my training programs. So thank you so much. Give this video a thumbs up and click subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.